Hello guys, welcome to another session. In this session, we are going to look into first of type and last of type child pseudo classes. So let's jump into the Visual Studio Code to understand this topic. So we are into the Visual Studio Code and this is the example which we have done earlier. But this time I have changed something. Here I have introduced a S2 tag prior to the first P tag. And here we are having the HR element which I have introduced after the last P tag. The repercussion which happened with this introducing of S2 tag and the last element now this code is not working so whatever the style which we were getting earlier now it is not coming so let's look into the output so here we told that we want the p tag the first p tag should be bold and the last one is also being bold so here you will see that it is not taking the style for the first and last child element so how we can make sure that to resolve the issue so to resolve this issue we are going to use another type of a structural pseudo class that is first of type and the last of type so let's write it so now what we will do we will come over here and we will replace the first child with first of type and the last child with the last of type so write last of type now save it and let's jump into the browser now you will see here that it has taken the style now because we are telling that whichever element will come within an article but the first p tag should be bold and the last p tag is also going to be bold so let's do some style change over here what we will do we will change the color and we will tell that it should be gray and here save it we can do it for first of type as well so we will tell that here color is going to be gray so save it now go to the browser so here you will see that now it is applying the style over here so it is printing or say it is displaying in gray and bold as we have a style like this and this is a first of type and this one is referring to the last of type so this way we can use first of type structural pseudo class as well as last of type a structural pseudo class so this is what i wanted to demonstrate to you in this session see you in the next session till then bye bye take care